All right, everybody, we're going to start today's episode out at the Red Lava Sea or whatever it's called. I don't know. So here's the deal. We need to start discussing this. And that's what if, hear me out, what if I can't get every star in the game? Which, Lethal Lava Land wasn't as bad, but I can already tell you, I'm not going to be able to get some of those. That's just, that's just how it is. Not going to be able to. So my goal is at a bare minimum, get 70 stars. That's what it takes to beat the base game. Just trying to see these. Every analog in my house is going bad. It's so annoying. I'm trying to play Xbox, and the analog on that is janked up. So, uh, it's very hard to play games when your right analog stick just wants to twirl. I think it gave me a headache. I can't see anything. I was playing ukulele today on the Xbox. There's a star. And, uh, after a while, and I may have just been my couch. Okay, well that's either going to be really easy or really hard. Now, ideally, I would like to break 90 or even 100. But with each level, it seems, you know, less and less likely. How close are we to this? Or is it underneath us? What's going on here? Like, where is this star? And my depth perception has never been amazing, but come on. I didn't even see it. Oh, hello. I hate myself for loving you, Mario. Okay, this 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 might not actually be that bad. What? 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 What in the what? This star looks obtainable. It looks like we just have to long jump at the right angle, though. Now, I'll admit, I should have, I should have gone and, uh, oh, for a second there, I thought I actually pulled that off. I should have gone and checked, um, how many stars were in this level. But after we get this star, I may just cut. Go and check, and see anything, Mario. Does he just cut out the middle room? Or you get the extra life? It's nice to be able to grab that. So, I need some extra coins. Coinage, you know. As you do when you're in the lava level. Alright, so let's... This one I think is just going to be a long jump. It's just... I mean, we might could even triple jump dive. The tricky part is just going to be getting the angle right. Take me a minute of looking. I just can't gauge that angle. Because that crap happens. Didn't even mean to grab those, but that. I mean, could you just jump down? I don't know. Ah. Alright, Mario, we gotta do this for real. What was that? I really don't know if there's an input delay on this or not. Obviously it can't be. Are you serious? 
Seriously? Okay, so there's like a dog outside or something. It's got my dogs all riled up. So if they just randomly bark, that's why. All right. Lava, lava. Fire C has four stars. All right, well, we know how to get that one, but we've been recording for a while and we haven't done anything. So we'll come back. I swear this hack has weird camera. Is it just me? Does anybody else notice this? Just me who thinks that this odds camera just will not sit still. So we're gonna go check out the last level of the basement, I'm pretty sure. Hazy Maisy Cavey. A level that I have learned to hate and enjoy. I certainly enjoy certain parts of this level. I certainly despise other parts of it. Okay. Guys, this is like the upstairs, baby. I knew it. So, it's hard to say that a level is going to be harder than the ones that we've been doing. But I knew this level was either going to be... Easiest level or the hardest level down here. So far, I think Dire Dire Docks has been the hardest, and then Lethal Lava Land might have been the easiest. By the time it's all said and done. Oh, well, we heard that. What is expected of us here, huh? So, may have to die a couple times experimenting. That is... How would I get up on this thing? Full jump. Not get up here? I don't guess so. Now, if you're really good, and I'm, I'm not, you can... Oh, that's like the first time I've ever done that. So now where would we go from... Can you get up on top of these? Do we want to triple jump dive for this? Okay. That wasn't that bad. Now again, for me, some of these stars are harder or at least more stress inducing because I cannot line up the camera. Like we should, by all accounts, have the one in Lethal Lava Land. Not Lethal Lava Land. The, uh... Flame Sea, Fire Sea. We should have that one by now. Oh. Um. But I could not line up the camera angle. Making it impossible for me to tell. Okay, my guess is he's done away with a lot of stuff. No, well, that's unfortunate. So this is what I was wondering, like how hard are the platformings going to be? About that to sneeze. I don't know, I didn't sneeze, so I'll either if I end up having to sneeze, I'll just cut it out and post. Or uh, I won't have to sneeze. What is this? Let's see, what can we do? What can we do? What can we do? Can you do this? I'm like forcing myself to learn new things. So I wanted to, okay. Try it like this. It looks doable. All right, this is a good start where we wanted to be. You guys know me, I'm super interested as in this. This should just be as easy as. 
<laughs> I'm loving this level. This level is so easy compared to the other levels down here. Jeez, this feels... I mean, it is course 6 after all, but this feels like a continuation of... Of, uh... The, the main level, of course. Need to bounce there. Alright, so I know... Let's see, because there's a jingle. I don't see anything. So we need to see if there's anything down here. There's so many offshoots. I'm honestly surprised at how easy we're finding these stars. Now, they weren't hidden in particularly tough places, to be fair. I had a randomizer where the star was right here. And by the way, if you haven't seen my randomizer, go do that. It's a West versus Jess race against the clock. Maybe I'll do an actual LP of a randomizer. I don't know. Hold on, give me a second. Let me... There's no caps, remember, if you're wondering, like, why? Is... Here it is. Make sure we don't see anything. That camera turned me around there. I thought there was just a star up under the elevator. Sometimes I wish this was just a tad bit easier. Like, the stars were hidden in harder places to find, but not necessarily as hard to... Well, I can't see anything, so I'm a dead man. So this is right here. Wow. I'm ba da ba 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 loving this. That was the sixth star, wow. Which we've proven time and time again the sixth star is not necessarily the hardest star. Also, I didn't change the desktop audio from the previous recording because when I was editing it, I actually didn't mind how it sounded. Now, the video has been edited, but I haven't put it up on YouTube yet, so we'll see. Um, if I like it, I may just leave it this way. I like how you can see stuff off in the background. I don't guess there's anything up here, but... Is there a train? I think there's a train, but... I'm wondering. He also did away with all the mystery boxes. I didn't realize that. Let's see. Awesome. Alright, so... I already... Uh, what is this? Well, depending on how this goes, this will either be... Easy like the rest of them, or... I don't want for my... Here. got to figure out like do I need a ground pound off of this do I need to just triple jump yeah, I really have no idea I may can just cheat I'm gonna try to cheat don't tell anybody you guys, you guys think he play tested that to make sure you couldn't do it everything else in this mod has seemed Got it. That may have just been what you're supposed to do. I don't know. All right, man. Ah, right, this this has been maybe my favorite level 
Don't get me wrong, we completed like all the upstairs levels. Even the dark world. Not the slide though, the slide has by far been the hardest level. But I guess if you're good at the game it may not be that hard, I don't know. I never do that when I play, so I now love doing the little booty slide. Alright, so no, I think this is like the last... I guess we haven't been. Anyway, this is like... This is like the ultimate upstairs level. It's taking everything we had to do from the upstairs and throwing it into one level. Which... Scares me for what the upstairs is gonna be like. It really is. Oh my gosh. I thought this was the other... path. Oh, junk. Guess not. I'm gonna come over here. Because there's still more exploring to do. And if there's nothing down here... Oh, darn it. Didn't mean to hit that wall. Health doesn't really matter. Probably got rid of Dory. Or... Bessie, or whatever her name is. I don't know. This is weird that there's one block. Oh, golly. What? What does it mean? Oh, no. She's here. Oh, this would be how you go and get that. Oh. Oh. Wow. Or it could be an easy way to get past that. I don't know. But let me see here. All right, I guess we're doing this. I don't remember how many are in here. I'm gonna guess it's by the waterfall. Oh, thank God. I don't even know how bad this is gonna be. Okay, but like, I see... I see that. What? And I hear it. What? Darn it, Mario. <laughs> I'll take it. I wish this would throw me out. Oh, it does, you genius. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Maybe that's why the camera angles have been so weird. I mean, look what it did. Now we can certainly just keep abusing that because he gave us such an easy star that if we happen to fall in the water again, it's okay because we can just grab that star and reset ourselves. This was unfortunate that we fell last time. Where is this? The star is more like in the event that we need it, not necessarily. Okay, Mario. Oh. Oh. Alright, I don't actually remember if there's a third one in there, so. I'm gonna call that that, and we're gonna go find this last star in here 
Obviously, we get a couple of guesses at where it could be. Would he hide it in here? Yes, he would. Alright, everybody. This has had to have been the most successful episode. So here's what I'm going to do. Since this episode is of appropriate length, I'm going to go try to get the lava, the fire lava level. But I'm not going to show any of it except when I get it. The reason being is I have a chance to make this a normal length episode. So, that's what I'm going to do. I will meet you guys either when I give up trying to get this star or when I get it. So, see how it goes. Alright, I actually will bring you guys along for the first attempt. That's because we're going to try something a little different. We're going to see if we can just jump off and get it. Now, I'm not sure from that angle if you can get it. I'm not even sure this angle. If you... Nope. I bet it's worth a shot. Uh, trying to get this lined up. Best way I can. The power bar is just always in the way for these stars. Okay. The, are you gonna move, camera? That was unfortunate. Okay, I think I want to catch this on the way down. I just go for it. was that <laughs> you gotta be up here it takes mario way too long to run up this hill all right mario you goofy plumber everything you work for golly come on okay round pound works too i guess <sighs> oh, this camera angle kills me. Literally. Sit. Boom. Okay. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I think it was one of our more successful episodes since the earlier ones. And, uh, you know, like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next exciting episode of Super Mario 64 and the Green Comets. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.